good morning one and all myself shrijana i am an assistant professor in lendi institute of engineering and technology today we are going to be discuss about the first chapter in pulse digital circuit scores the first chapter is linear wave shaping and this linear wave shaping we are going to discuss about the high pass rc circuit for this high pass rc circuit we are now finding out the transfer function of hp rc here what is meant by a transfer function the transfer function is nothing but the output by input voltage is nothing but a transfer function so we have to find out now the transfer function of hp rc okay this is the circuit diagram of rc circuit of high pass here we are having two components one is capacitor and resistor that is why it is called as a rc circuit and we are collecting the output across the resistor and it is becoming high pass rc circuit here here first of all transfer function is nothing but transfer function is of hp rc is h of s equal to v output by v input okay now we have to find out the output by input equations to find out the output by input equations we have to apply kvl at input side and output side okay now apply kvl now apply kvl at input side and output side at input side and and output side now v input of t equal to 1 by c integral of i of t into dt plus r into i of t make this equation 1 and the output equation v output of t equal to we are collecting the output across the resistor as shown in the figure so the output equation equal to r into i of t make it as equation 2 okay now apply laplace transform to both the equation 1 and 2 okay now apply now apply laplace transform to equation 1 and 2 then it is represented as then it is represented as v input of s equal to 1 by sc into i of s plus r into i of s and v output of s equal to r into i of s make this as equation 3 and equation 4 okay now substitute equation 3 and 4 in equation a this is the equation a the equation a is nothing but the transfer function output by input okay so for finding out the transfer function of the circuit we have to know the output equation and input equation now substitute both these two equations in the transfer function formula h of s equal to output r into i of s by 1 by sc into i of s plus r into i of s now taking common r into i of s by i of s into 1 by sc plus r okay 1 by sc plus r now cancel the i of s and i of s then h of s is represented as r by r plus 1 by s c okay now simplify this equation it is represented as as like this r s c by r s c plus 
okay taking common r into sc plus 1 by sc this sc will goes upside then it is represented as rsc by 1 plus uh, rsc here it can be represented as it can also represented as like this sc into rc by sc into rc plus 1 here it is represented as like this sc into tau by 1 plus s tau this is the transfer function of high pass rc circuit here the tau is nothing but the product of r and c components which is used in this circuit okay here the tau is nothing but the product of r and c components which is used in this circuit okay this is the transfer function of this is the transfer function of HPRC okay using this transfer function you can find out the output expressions for different non sinusoidal signals applied to this circuit okay understand in this session we have discussed about how the transfer function of HPRC is calculated okay thank you